everything you were taught to believe in was a hoax? What if your entire value system were to be reweighed? What if Batman were only a comic book hero? What if your high school guidance counselor didn't have a clue? What if you signed up for the wrong class? What if the last seven plus years has been a political nightmare closing in on you even if you weren't paying attention? What if you didn't even care to hear or think about these questions? Well, I offer you just that. More questions than answers. And heretofore, declare my candidacy for the instructor of this class. Well, that's very clever of my counterpart here to pose the rhetorical <laughs> questions. I submit that there will be no real intent to give you a clue how he intends to proceed once the semester really gets <coughs> underway. Excuse me. The point is that the semester is already underway, and my questions have already been floating above this class seeking audience, looking for a pathway to understanding. Pardon? Is that by any means germane? I mean, for the sake of argument, because that's why we're here today, let me ask, do you want unanswerable questions thrown at you? I mean, after a lifetime of being told what was expected of you, wouldn't you be just as comfortable to be given the answers outright? Or would you prefer the option of thinking, reasoning, and feeling on your own? If so, imagine how refreshing to have someone, anyone, be honest with you. This is my pledge. <laughs> well, it sounds like a pledge offered as a challenge without a syllabus of support to back it up. A pledge that can only have been concocted some four long years ago in the city of Siena during the night of the polio under the influence of grappa. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a reference that escapes almost everybody here except maybe three of us. <laughs> so, tell me, good sir, while the floor is yours, what are the issues here? I mean, what is truly at stake? What possibly is written in italics that simply doesn't show up on any approved syllabus? Thank you. Let's start with questions. Are there any, in fact, any questions that could be satisfactorily answered? Is, if it's true that we learn from the past and live in the present and move toward the future, then what's it all about, Alfie? Was there life? before cell phones and blackberries? If guessing were an art form, would that make you Picasso come final time? <laughs> Are you waiting for the corporate cyberspace meeting to show you how to live your life? Have you already given over to those dark side musings clutching on your left shoulder? Who should you believe and or what should you believe in? Is it really worth the effort? Well, don't touch that dial. You lose the buzz. My pledge is secondary. Yours is worth looking for, worth cultivating. Captivate yourself. Take back your world. When did you lose it? Do you have any idea how to delineate prose or walk in the undulating surf of poetry? And if you did, but found it wasn't cool to do so, would you risk it? Is it worth fighting for your oppression to really appreciate your freedom? Yes, 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 and again, yes. I imperatively agree, but we're jumping ahead. Let's take a step back. We want to turn over your education back to you. It's time for you to explore. Let's start with the basics. Now, please, everyone, take out a full piece of paper, please. Now, on this paper, we would like you to print your name, your major, your class standing, your own personal standing, and then write extemporaneously about now, here and now, and the fleeting ephemeral consciousness that runs just ahead of the two. But call it the immediate future or uh, grasping the ungraspable. In other words, what do you really want? What in the world is worth fighting for? No, just write. Don't correct spelling. Don't edit. Allow whatever flows from your heart. But give yourself the gift of acceptance. Well, if you need an imposed motivation, this is your first quiz of the semester. But all you have to do is keep writing for four minutes, and the grade of A is yours. So let me repeat. Your name, your major, 
your class and personal standing. Then write on the topic what you truly want and what in the world is worth fighting for. You have four minutes. Please begin.